जो गरीब है जो पिछड़ा है जो एलिजिबल है उसको जो है वो तरक्की की धारा में शामिल होना चाहिए ये हमारा संकल्प है Prominent minority face of the BJP, Mukhtar Abbas Naqvi, has recently resigned from the post of Minority Affairs Minister as his term comes to an end. He was also the deputy leader of the upper house. With his resignation coming a day before the end of his Rajya Sabha term, there are speculations that the party may nominate Naqvi for the vice presidential election to be held on August 6th. Mukhtar Abbas Naqvi is a well-known Muslim leader who has contributed to pro-Hindutva BJP. Raised in a devout family in the village of Bhadari, Allahabad, Uttar Pradesh, Naqvi has always been attracted to social movements. He has been a member of the Sampurna Kranti movement. Naqvi's education in mass communication has made him one of the nation's best communicators and opinion leaders. His political career began in 1980 as a candidate for the Janata Party but the election turned out to be unsuccessful later he contested as an independent candidate in the Ayodhya constituency in the 1980s Lok Sabha elections in 1988 Nakvi won the Lok Sabha seat in Uttar Pradesh's Rampur elections In 1998 during the reign of Atal Bihari Vajpayee Mukhtar Abbas Naqvi was assigned the post of Minister of State for the Ministry of Information and Broadcasting From 2010 to 2016 Naqvi was elected as an MP of the Rajya Sabha for Uttar Pradesh and later was appointed as the Minister of State for Minority Affairs in 2016 Mukhtar Abbas Naqvi again took his oath in 2019 and continued serving in the Minority Affairs Ministry. Furthermore, he became a member of the party's Central Election Committee and in charge of the BJP's organization. Mukhtar Abbas Naqvi declared August 1st as the Muslim Women's Rights Day, commemorating the criminalization of instant triple talaq. Nakwi also pushed for providing equal opportunities, promoted minority education. Nakwi provided scholarships to several students. The scholarship was intended to reduce the dropout rate and promote female education. Nakwi's mantra of reform, perform and transform for the weaker sections made India the first country to perform entire process of Hajj registration online. Moreover, Nakvi also played quite an important role in ensuring and facilitating women going to Hajj without a mahram for the first time. This enabled and encouraged thousands of women who could not go to Hajj before alone. Nakvi has also pushed for livelihood of artisans. Project Hunar Hat started in 2016 under Nakvi's leadership. The project was intended to empower India's artisans and craftsmen by providing them with access to incredible job opportunities. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.